today's video, I'm going to be rating every single Splatoon 1 Splatfest theme ever. This is going to be a tier list, and here are the tiers. If you want this to be a series, leave a like, and I'll do a part 2 on every Splatoon 2 Splatfest. Enjoy! Cat vs Dogs was the first Splatfest ever. Yet, yeah, I mean ever. And even though I never played any of the Splatoon 1 Splatfest, this one looked amazing. I personally would have been on Team Dog though, because I just love dogs, and I'm just saying, they would definitely never jump off my fireplace just to go to the litter box. I'll give this Splatfest B tier. Pretty solid first Splatfest. Roller Coasters vs Water Slides was the second Splatoon 1 Splatfest. I personally do not like either, but if I had to choose, I would rather go Water Slides, mainly because they look way more fun than Roller Coasters. I'll give this one a solid C tier though. Pretty cool Splatfest. This Splatfest definitely seemed like a fun one. I personally really like marshmallows, and I'd rather have them over hot dogs any day of the week. Hot dogs are not that bad, but marshmallows are just way better. This Splatfest theme was definitely a better one, so I'll give it an A tier for how fun it looked. This Splatfest was the first ever collab Splatfest in the Splatoon series, which was an obvious collab with the Transformers. I would have been on Autobots mainly because growing up, even though I barely watched Transformers, I would absolutely hate Decepticons. I just want to see tier though, it's not bad, but it's also not very good. I still got both of these topics, but I'd rather be on Team Science. This would be the first Splatfest I would pick because of the colors, because this theme was really kind of dull to me. If I played this fest, I probably wouldn't even think about the topic. This one is definitely going in D tier. This Splatfest definitely sounded like a pretty fun one. I would have been on cars because planes are, in my opinion, just uncomfortable and I feel way more safer in a car. But I will definitely put this one in A tier though. Pretty good thing. For this one, I'm definitely on Team Ninja all the way. If ninjas and pirates really had a fight, pirates would have swords and cannons most likely, and ninjas with smokes, grenades, and also swords. Ninjas are taking that one easily. They will barely even be detected, which means they won't even be fired at. But since I'm rating these S tiers, it's like a pretty fun theme though. This one, I'm definitely on Team Pizza. I just prefer pizzas. I mean, you can't go wrong with one. Anyways, B tier, pretty basic theme. This one, I'm kind of conflicted with, but for this flat fest, I would probably go naughty. It's fun joking around. Anyways, this thing was pretty cool for Christmas Splatfest though, so I'll go. I'll get an F tier. This is another great Splatfest theme that has a lot of thought that can go into it. For example, in the past, you could be like living in dinosaur ages or like you know ages before like electronics and stuff. But in the future, you could be living like with everything's better though. So I'd probably go future here, but I'll give this one S tier because yeah, there's just a lot of more dangerous stuff back then. This is probably one of my favorite Splatfest themes and it's a shame I couldn't play it. I'll give this one an X tier. One of the best Splatfest themes of all time in my opinion. I would have been on Pokemon Red because I just prefer Charizard. Since this one isn't a season question, like would I rather stay in the winter or the summer? Because then I would have went winter. But because of this question on which one is better, I'll go with Sandcastles. Because they just have so much more options. You can make a super large kingdom or just a basic castle. So yeah, Sandcastle all the way. I'll give this one an A tier. It's a pretty solid theme, not gonna lie. This one, I'm definitely on Patrick's side. Both of them are iconic, but Patrick is definitely funnier. And in my opinion, the better character in general. I rarely watched Spongebob or even watched Spongebob in the past, but what I do know is Patrick is the funnier character. It was, is a great collab though, so I'll give it an X rank. This Splatfest is a simple answer for me. I'm definitely going costume party, because most formal clothes for me just feel uncomfortable. Another solid theme though, I'll give it an A rank. This Splatfest is also one of the easiest answers for me. Night Owl. Almost every night this year, I've been up past midnight. Normally working on a video. I'm pretty sure while screaming this video, I've been up till 5 a.m. running it. Anyways, B tier for this one though. I'm not gonna lie. This this script was kind of written, you know, in 2023, like uh, September 2023. So that made a little bit more sense back then. You know, it's 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 the 8th of 2024 right now, so it doesn't really make sense. But I swear, I've still been a night owl. Yeah. Okay. Next Splatfest. And now here is the final US Splatfest and final Splatoon 1 Splatfest in general. Kelly vs. Marie. This one, before I even state what team I'm on, is definitely an X tier. This was a great end for Splatoon 1 and its result greatly tied to the Splatoon 2 story. I would have been on Marie's side for this one though. As I never really liked Kelly, I always preferred Marie and I still prefer Marie to this day. And if you watched the Amiibo video, you would also know that. Because you know, I did say Kelly is the inferior sister sister because she is. Marie's just way better. Those are all the American Splatfests, and so now it's time to rate the Europe ones. Well, also, I mean, like, you know, like, if you, I mean, if you want to, like, where I rate all the idols, like, including the band members, you know, you can hit that like button. I can also do that, you know what I'm saying? Because I know you already like the Amiibo video. For this Splatfest, I would have been on Team Rock, because sometimes I cannot stand pop music. 
and I like rock music just a little bit more though. C tier for this theme though. As I mentioned earlier with the Night Owl versus Early Bird Splatfest, I barely get a good amount of sleep. So I'd be on Team E for this one. B tier Splatfest though. I'd be on Team North for this one. I feel like the North as a whole has more options than the South Pole. So North Pole. This Splatfest was kind of random though, so I'll give it D tier. It wasn't really that good of a Splatfest in my opinion. I cannot do any of these, but probably singing. I'd rather sing than do a TikTok dance, so there you go. C tier for the Splatfest. This was terrible. My room is a mess. Like, it's actually very messy. So I'd be on Team Messy for this one. I normally don't really care if something is messy because I can normally find what I need anyways. Surprisingly, even after I clean my room, I can rarely find stuff. But I'll give it B tier for this Splatfest. Solid theme, and I do like the colors. For this one, I'd be on Team Zombies. They're easier to fight, and they don't take much time to kill with the right supplies. Meanwhile, ghosts fade through walls, can't die with just gunshots, and they're a pain to deal with. So zombies for the win. Also, if simple plants can just kill zombies, they aren't a pain. I really like this scene though, so I'll give it S+. This Splatfest is kind of just stupid. F tier, it's a stupid question, but delicious because who wants their food to be disgusting? Like, let's think about this. You could rather have a delicious 5-star gourmet food, or you could have slop. Who was even on Team Disgusting here? Personally, I would be on Team Fit instead of having a lot of money. I'd rather want to feel like I'm bettering myself instead of just being rich. I'm sure this question has way more logic into it, but I'm not going to get into that for the sake of the time in this video, but I will give it A rank. This splat is just basically ninja versus pirates, so still ninjas for the wins, for the same reason. I also put in the same tier as I put pirates versus ninjas, so S tier. <laughs> this one I would be on Team Hoverboard. It just sounds way more fun and you won't be right next to Jet Fuel, which could be scary. So hoverboard for the win here. I will give this one a B tier though, not very bad, but I mean, also not a very good theme. World Tour for me. Space is a cool thing, but it's also way more deadly. So World Tour. It's another Splatfest that could actually bring up a good discussion, so I'll give it A tier. And that is every Splatoon 1 Splatfest ever. Let me know if in the comments section if you agree with this list or what your own list would be. And leave a like and maybe subscribe if you want a Splatoon 2 version. And that's about it. See ya.